So what am I going to report on today? Wallaby Row and Alvpairs has revealed some concept images for the re-theme of their old village to fit with the Festival City theme which will be taking place in the 2020 season. Hello there guys, my name is Curtis Chow, YouTube channel, Doncaster Born, but built for Think Park News. Before we get started, we have some shout outs. Shout outs go to Brian Galeas, Falco Flair, and Lucas Epic15. If you want a shout out in our next video, comment down below. Secondly, I have to admit, this video has been recorded after I've just finished pre recording the UK theme park season review for 2019. In that video, we're talking about uh, the, new, the main new attractions at the big parks uh, for this year, talking about attractions that were announced for future years, the trips we've done on the channel this year, and also just a summary of the event and how much you guys mean to me as followers and subscribers. So, thank you very much for all the support on the channel this year. Make sure you stay tuned for that video when it gets released. It's a long video, it's around about half an hour, nearly half an hour. Uh, so it's a long it's, it's a long one, but stay tuned for, for all of it because it's well worth watching every single part of it. Uh, so I hope you guys are raring to go with that. Make sure you go check out uh, the videos over the last few days. We've had some pl we had plenty of news updates yesterday uh, from Knott's Berry Farm. Uh, we've had news update from Blackpool Pleasure Beach. Uh, we've got plenty of new stuff still to come over the next few days. Don't forget, uh, later on today we've got a close but not forgotten episode from Ramesses Revenge at Chessington World of Adventure Resort. Now that ride is closed, so stay tuned for that video later today. And of course we've got plenty of other stuff to come over the next few days as well. This is a theme park news update then from Wallaby Roan Alpes. Now soft opened on the 25th of May this year and then officially opened on the 30th of May this year was their custom infinity coaster by Gerslauer called Mystic in a brand new festival city area that included the re-theme of their uh, drop tower, their shot tower. Um, now to continue on with that festival city theme and to bridge the gap uh, with the Mystic area we, also, we, are, we now have a brand new concept art for a re-theme of their old village section. Uh, so no new attractions as much. It's very much a general improvement year next year, which is a good move for Rowan Alpes to sort of improve the experience of the theme park. Uh, but we do have some official concept images and some information we'd like to share with you on the new sort of re-theme of the village. So on your screen right now, Fandabidorsi, that is some concept art on your screen. And basically, for those of you who want a little bit of information about this, the old village will be rethemed. It's the oldest area in the park and will be modified to remove the WAB theming and get uh, the festival city treatment. Uh, it will have new restaurants and they'll move the carousel into another place in the area located between Mystic and the Valdu area and the entrance with the Star Flyer. So it's pretty much going to be a complete retheme year. Um, so it's going to be brand new restaurants, a brand new style with the village. And of course, the brand new relocated, relocated carousel. Uh, so that's going to be painted up very nicely, and it's going to be relocated to a new section of land in between the entrance of the Star Flyer and, of course, that Valdu area where Mystic is. So I think this is a very strong investment, personally. Uh, I'd like to, it'd be lovely to see some concept art in the future with the restaurants, because I'm sure they're going to really spruce them up and paint them up really nicely. Uh, of course, these are brand new restaurants, so I'm thinking that uh, they could go with some different food option styles. Maybe go with a roller coaster restaurant style if they wanted to. Uh, but it doesn't look like that from the concept type. It seems like it should be just general restaurants. Uh, so that's pretty good. But I'd like to see some more roller coaster restaurants or food loops from the Europa parks, they're called, uh, go into these European parks and more European parks. Uh, so it would be nice. Uh, but for now, I think this is going to be a general improvement year, like we said. Um, just general spruce up year. Uh, and I think that's the right thing to do. Obviously, with Wallaby Belgium, I think they're going with a more improvement year next year as well. Um, now, I believe, comment down below if I'm wrong about this, but I think like the entrance area refurbishment has been moved back a year uh, to the same year as the Mega Coaster in 2021. Again, comment down below if I'm mistaken or not. But. I think that's what they're doing, and they're just going to be retheming that whole flashback log flume and pulsar area uh, into, into something new, basically. Uh, so again, just overall, whatever the case, it's a general spruce up year. Same with Wallaby Row and Alpes, uh, and I'm sure Wallaby Holland are going to be uh, sprucing up their, well, giving a new racetrack theme to that whole Goliath section. 
uh, with look, what looks like some new family drop towers. We reported on that a little bit, uh, well, a couple of months earlier. So make sure you go and watch that video from Wallaby Holland if you haven't already. So overall, between the three main Wallaby parks, it's a refurbishment, spruce up, improvement year uh, next year. So the Wallaby parks are taking a back seat after they took a massive uh, front seat this year with the opening of Mystique at Rowan Alpes, Untamed, which is RMC Robin Hood at Wallaby Holland, and of course Wallaby Belgium um, sort of doing their own thing. Um, and doing some nice improvements in that year as well. So I think that Wallaby Belgium um, is going to have the big new addition in 2021 because they missed out on a big new addition in 2019. Obviously, Holland and Rowan Alpes took the front seat for the Wallaby Parks uh, with their new coasters this year. But all of them are taking a back seat for 2020. And of course, Wallaby Belgium is going to go full force in 2021 with the new mega coaster. So there we go. So thank you very much for watching this small theme park news update on Wallaby Rowan Alpes. Overall, then, my thoughts. Very, very good improvements and new restaurants going in. Carousel, I'm sure it's going to be nicely spruced up. Uh, what are your thoughts then on this new improvement? Comment down below and I'll reply to your comments. Make sure you like the video if you've loved it. Comment down below and subscribe to the channel and click the notification bell so you never miss a YouTube video. Share the channel around with your friends and family. Share this channel on social media. Let's get this channel up to 2,000 subscribers before the end of the year. Thank you very much. My name is Coach Chow. Killing the coast of life, and I'll see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Take care, have an awesome day, my friends.